Hello everyone and welcome back to See Lynn Plays Afterlife the Second Dimension. It's been a while since I recorded this and I don't know what I'm supposed to do next so I'm following a video guide. Honestly I'm a little bit scared and nervous because I don't know what's gonna happen from here on out but I know that it's most likely gonna be scary. Anyway, um, I guess we go back out. Oh, that was loud. Maybe we explore, I don't know. Can't do anything here. Oh, we could go this way. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, I was not expecting that to happen, but thanks anyway. Well, I guess we'll go up here. I really don't know what I'm doing. Um, I hope there's a save here. Nope. Well, we'll obviously look at everything. Nobody knows, but I found a way to get outside. However, the door is sealed by a complicated mechanism. I want to get out of here. Why don't they want us to leave the sanctuary? I have to solve this puzzle. Huh, I wonder what the puzzle is. The Princess from the Gold Castle by Henry Pigeon or Pigeon. Once upon a time, a young princess living in a great golden castle. Every morning she opened the windows to feel the gentle morning breeze. Then she began to blank and blank Oh, for... Oh, that could mean anything. The other pages are too damaged to be read. Anyway, I don't like fairy tales. You don't seem like a person that would like that type of stuff anyway. There is a picture at the end of the story. Looks like the girl in the fairy tale. Uh, I guess we look through the lockers here? That's a little risky though, because what if that thing is hiding in there? There's a window. Open. Sure. What about this one? Yay, a door! I hope we could save. Well, there's no- <gasps> Oh my god. Can I please save? Nope. 27 atomic bombs crashed on our planet during the Third World War. Since that day, a thick white cloud is floating in the air. It covers the sky completely. No scientist has been able to explain the phenomenon. Why is there no music playing? This is... This feels so weird. There's nobody around here. Where do they go? I don't know, but can we save? No! I guess the only place we can go to is up or down. It's locked. Oh, okay, I guess we go down then. There's a hole in the wall. Enter. Sure. Oh, I'm nervous. Oh, that's not a good sign. Blood on the ground. Okay, let's not step in that. I got scared. We have a big area to it. What the hell was that? I guess we go this way. I don't know. Oh my god. This is... That was creepy. However, we did find this. Small key, you don't... I hope nothing chases me. I'm not prepared for this. Okay, I guess it's for that door. I'm praying that nothing chases me. We need good energy. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! 
I said good energy, not scared and heart attack energy. Oh my god. <laughs> I use a small key. Thank you, Lord. Where's the save? There's a map on the table. A red cross marks a location. Uh, I don't know where that is. Bruh. If you read this, go immediately to the fortress. Water, food, supply, and shelter. Circulate through the sewers. God bless us all. But I don't want to go back down there. After what just happened. Oh my god. Please don't be down here. I'm not going back inside. Dang it! I missed the save point. Yeah, the video guide I was watching showed where the save point in there is and now I can't go back. Oh, what's the map thing over here? This place is indicated by the map, but there's only a stone. Wait a second, there's a switch on the side. Sweet. Except I can't save, so... Fingers crossed I don't die, others have to do all this again. There's a hole in the ground. Enter the hole. Yes. Oh my god, why is it dark? I hate this. I need to find another save spot ASAP. Oh my god, there's a save! Thank you! Uh, that was an accident. Um, do I enter here? Maybe I do, maybe I don't. I don't know. I don't. Okay. Why is the music so creepy to me? I feel like something's gonna jump out at me any moment. Oh my god, stop. Stupid. Oh, maybe we go down here? I don't know. I really don't know what I'm doing. I'm debating on throwing my headphones off because this music is unsettling. Well, this music is a lot better, but still unsettling. I guess we'll go this way. Huh, I hear someone whispering. It seems to come from the south. Oh my god. Hi. How many now? Seven? Eight? I'm lost here forever. Everyone's gone. Kazuki! And now I hear her voice. Yuna. Kazuki. Huh? What? Yuna. Oh. Kazuki, you idiot. Why did you do that? I'm so sorry, Yuna. I'm sorry. Do not ever do that again, you hear me? Yeah, don't leave me alone. <laughs> I promise. Thank God. Tell me, how did you manage to get here? Well, strangely, they all have been attracted by a sound. I can't tell what it was. After that, the soldiers of the New World Security finally arrived. So, we were in front of the gates of the fortress, and these things came out of nowhere and attacked us. I'm the only one who survived. I see. But the weirdest thing is, no one opened the gates. I called for help, but nothing happened, so I ran away. I found a house to hide, not far from here. It's okay, Kazuki, you had no other choice. You're alive and that's all that matters. Yuna. Thank you. It's nothing. Wait, you haven't told me yet. How did you get here, too? I thought you were searching for your parents. That's what I was doing, but the path leading to my home was blocked by a landslide. So I tried to take a shortcut and, well, here I am. I see. But I don't think they're still at your home. What do you mean? They certainly left towards the fortress too. You're right, so what should we do? First, let's get some rest before moving on. 
You know, I thought a lot about this and why not live here? Just the two of us. Yuna, what are you talking about? What about your parents? Are you trying to say that they are... Yuna, it's been only one day since the incident. We can't surrender now. The soldier's gonna find us soon, and they'll put an end to this terror. How can you tell that? They're all dead. Yuna! I'm sorry. Don't think about it. We're gonna get through this, but we need to stay positive, okay? Okay. We'll try to find a way to get inside the fortress. Your parents are still alive, okay? Are you sure about that? Yeah. Yeah, you're right. I can't believe I thought that. Don't worry about it. You didn't really think of it. Now you need to sleep. We leave at dawn. Okay. It's pretty dark in the bedroom. You'll need this. A flashlight. About time. Thank you. Good night. Good night. You ready? Sure. Good. Let's go then. It's still dark outside, but since they heard this weird sound, I haven't seen them again. So don't worry, we'll be fine. Are you sure about that? Press Q to turn on flashlight and W to turn it off. I'm not gonna remember that. I'm keeping it on the whole time, I don't care. Oh, thank you lord, there's a save. Alright everyone, I think I'm gonna leave this part here. I'm a little bit nervous about what's gonna happen next. I had quite a few scares in this video and... Well, yeah, it's kinda expected since this is a horror game. But yeah, anyways guys, thank you all so much for watching. And I guess I will see you all next time in another Afterlife the Second Dimension video. Or whatever I make next. Goodbye for now. Oh.